thank you for joining my fabulous people if this is your first time to my channel welcome if you're returning welcome back i know it's been a while but anyways welcome back so today i just want to share five reasons you need to have a home-based business i know previously i always talked about um, being a teacher of vfb kids and this and the other i still do that i don't do it as much um just because i have other things going on and i've realized that i've because i've had that as an independent contractor plus my businesses that a lot of people don't understand the importance of having a home-based business especially in the season in which we are in it is it is it is <laughs> It is so vital to your financial future to have a home-based business that it is mind-boggling, okay? Mind-boggling, okay? To the point where Congress has changed so many tax laws that is in your benefit. They need for you, want you to have a home-based business. If you have a business already, that's great, but it's important that you have a home-based business. Now, what are the five reasons why you need the, the home-based business? First of all, number one, you, you can keep or get more money in your pocket. Okay, let me say that again. One, you can keep or get more money in your pocket. And I'll talk to that a little bit further in, in other videos. Number two, there are 475 tax write-offs that you can get as a home-based business owner. If you think I'm lying, I will leave the publication, the link, you can search for yourself. It is, it is 475, okay? Number three, you can hire your children, you can hire your ch children and write off, listen to what I'm gonna tell you, and write off $12,400 per child per child i'm not kidding you can hire your children and they do not have to pay any taxes as well especially if they are under um, 18 and if they are over 18 there's other loopholes that you can really do that so you can cover yourself okay um number four you can write a, a portion of your home your rent your mortgage your utilities your cell phone, car expenses, um, just countless other expenses that you would normally like, what? I can write those things up? Yes, you can. Whether you rent, whether you own a home. If you have a home-based business, you can do this, okay? Also, you can write off your travel, okay? So it's you're no longer just going on vacations. Now, you are the mindset that you are going on business trips. And I will explain to that later on in some other videos on how that needs to look like. So if you have not established a home-based business, you need to establish that. And so what I'm saying to you is that you don't necessarily need to be a part of VIP Kid. It's great. You might be, there might be other programs out there. Of course, somebody want to call me right now. Um, other programs that are out there, or maybe you have a hobby, okay, something that you that you do and you like doing it and maybe you you charge a couple of people or you have something where you are a consultant everybody could be a consultant okay so if you have not have a a home-based business and there's something that you can, you can be a consultant if you are a teacher you are considered an educational consultant okay so outside of, especially this time everybody's working from home teachers you are working from home you are teaching okay so you need to get some of that money back that you are spending as you are home. So now you become an educational consultant. Maybe you like to cook, you are a cooking consultant. You do not have to set up um, and open up a corporation, whatever, because there's gonna be a sole proprietor. That's the most important thing. Your home-based business is sole, it's a sole proprietorship or your LLC is um, one member. Okay, it's an LLC if you want more protection, whatever your business might be, or you are a sole proprietor because you're gonna write your 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 taxes, your write-offs will come off of your personal taxes. That is your 1040, your schedule C on your 1040, your, that's your schedule C. All right. So I just want to share that information with you all because I've 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 been noticing a lot of um, people just don't know, and I've been really trying to. This is my mission now. 
to be honest with you this is my mission this is a passion that i have to really help people to build their financial legacy because we can't keep talking about welcome to the rich get rich and they get all the they don't have to pay taxes they don't have to do it you have to know how to play the game you so in order for you to play the game you have to understand how to play it and you cannot get to the mindset that oh it's too much time it's too much paperwork there there are apps I'm going to link that below. There are courses that you can take. I'm linking that below as well. All those things I'm linking below because you have to get educated. You just can't just go and buy a willy nilly and think it's just going to happen. No, you have to understand because your accountant, your tax preparer, yeah, they serve their purpose, but there's a lot of things they're servicing a lot of people. So you have to be able to know what is important and under understand as well and be proactive about your financial legacy and what is it that you need to do all right so if you have any questions you can always direct message me you can leave a message below comment below do that all right do that do that because this is important this this is important and there are things out there to help you out but you have to know how to play the game and that's what i want to help you to do all right so thank you so much for joining my fabulous people. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you comment, comment, subscribe, hit the bell button so you know when I upload, upload videos because I am here to help you build your financial legacy. All right. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank you.